Imagine drifting through the endless expanse of the universe, where stars are born and die in dazzling displays of cosmic power. Among these celestial giants, there's one star that has captivated humanity's imagination since the dawn of time. Our sun, the heart of our solar system, the source of light and life on Earth. But how does our sun compare when placed side by side with the colossus that reigns as the universe's biggest star? Today, we embark on a stellar journey, from the comforting warmth of our backyard star to the awe-inspiring might of the largest star known to exist. Buckle up for an interstellar comparison that will expand your understanding of the cosmos and our place within it. Welcome to Sun vs. the Biggest Star in the Universe. Let's start with the star that defines our days and nights, the Sun. It's a massive sphere of burning plasma holding the title as the center of our solar system. With a diameter of about 1.4 million kilometers, it's large enough to fit Earth inside it over 1 million times. Situated approximately 93 million miles from our home planet, this colossal distance is known as an astronomical unit, the yardstick for measuring space within our solar system. The sun's surface temperature blazes at around 5,500 degrees Celsius, but this pales in comparison to its core, where temperatures soar to about 15 million degrees Celsius, fueling nuclear fusion that lights up our solar system. Its estimated lifespan is about 10 billion years, and it's currently middle-aged, at around 4.6 billion years old. This gives us plenty of time to enjoy its life-giving radiance, but also to ponder our existence in the grand timeline of the universe. In terms of its role, the sun does more than light up our days and provide warmth. It's the massive gravitational force that keeps our solar system in harmony. Planets, asteroids, and comets are tethered in their orbits by this force. The light from the sun not only allows us to see during the day, but also energizes the planet, driving weather patterns and giving energy to plants which form the base of most food chains. To truly appreciate the sun's magnificence, let's dive into some stunning visuals. Imagine high-definition images capturing solar flares and prominences, towering loops of plasma dancing on the sun's surface. These visuals not only highlight the sun's beauty, but its volatile nature. Solar animations can show the dynamic surface of the sun with its swirling spots of intense magnetic activity and the ever-changing ballet of solar material. Through these images and animations, we gain a deeper appreciation of our sun's complex and vibrant nature, a constant reminder of the dynamic universe we're a part of. Let's journey from our familiar solar cornerstone to the realm of cosmic giants. The title of the biggest star in the universe currently goes to a leviathan known as UY Scuti. Situated in the constellation Scutum, this colossal star is a staggering example of stellar immensity. To put its size into perspective, if the sun were a mere basketball, UY Scuti would tower as a sphere the height of Mount Everest. This giant's diameter is about 1,700 times that of our sun making it so vast that light takes several hours to travel around its circumference compared to the mere 14.5 seconds it takes to circle the sun. Located approximately 9,500 light years away from us, UI Scuti challenges our comprehension with its sheer scale. Its temperature, while cooler than the sun's surface, still blazes at an impressive estimate of around 3,500 Kelvin. But with great size comes a shorter lifespan, Stars like UI Scuti burn through their nuclear fuel much quicker than smaller stars, meaning its time in the cosmos is relatively fleeting on a cosmic scale. As we unveil UI Scuti through high-definition visuals and animations, the comparison between it and our Sun becomes startlingly clear. Imagine, if you will, our solar system superimposed next to UI Scuti. This behemoth star would engulf not just Mercury, Venus, Earth, but extend far beyond likely swallowing up Jupiter and beyond. The visualization of this comparison not only highlights the immense diversity in star sizes within our universe, but also underscores the special, albeit smaller, nature of our own sun. Now that we've explored our local star, it's time to turn our telescopes towards the reigning giant of the cosmos, UI Scuti. This colossal star, located in the constellation Scutum, stands as the current record holder for the largest known star in the universe. To put its enormity into perspective, if the sun were a mere one meter wide beach ball, UI Scuti would be a breathtaking 1.2 kilometers in diameter. 
Situated approximately 9,500 light years away from Earth, UI Scooty's sheer size makes our Sun look like a mere dot in comparison. With an estimated temperature around 3,500 Kelvin, it's cooler than our Sun, but its size allows it to shine with a luminosity over 340,000 times that of the Sun. Its lifespan, however, is much shorter. Massive stars like UI Scooty burn through their nuclear fuel much faster, leading to a life expectancy of only a few million years, a blink in cosmic time. In our comparative analysis, let's delve into the specifics. Starting with size, UI Scooty's diameter is about 1,700 times that of the Sun. When it comes to volume, the comparison becomes even more staggering. If the Sun were a single basketball, UI Scooty could engulf enough basketballs to fill an entire sports arena. In terms of brightness, despite its cooler surface temperature, UI Scooty's immense size allows it to outshine our Sun substantially. However, it's worth noting that this brightness is spread across its vast surface area making it less intense per square meter than the surface of the Sun. The mass of UI Scooty, while significantly larger than the Sun's, does not scale linearly with its size due to its less dense outer layers. Yet the mass is crucial in determining the star's fate, as it drives the star's evolution and eventual death. Stars like UI Scooty, with their massive reserves of fuel, live fast and die young, often ending their lives in spectacular supernovae, leaving behind either a neutron star or a black hole. Lastly, the distance of UI Scooty from Earth puts into perspective the vast scales involved in astronomy. At 9,500 light years away, the light we see from UI Scooty today began its journey towards us in the early human civilization's era. This distance and the sheer scale of such stars remind us of our place in the universe, offering a humbling view of our cosmic surroundings. The impact of a star on its orbiting planets is profound, affecting everything from their climates to the potential for life. Orbiting our Sun, Earth finds itself in the so-called Goldilocks zone. Not too hot, not too cold, but just right for liquid water and life as we know it. The Sun's stable output of light and warmth has nurtured life on Earth for billions of years, its gravitational pull keeping our planet in a nearly circular orbit that ensures relatively stable conditions. Now, let's transport our imaginations into a universe where Earth orbits UI Scuti. Immediately, we encounter a scenario that defies our current understanding of habitability. Given UI Scuti's colossal size, if Earth were to orbit it at the same distance as it orbits the Sun, we'd be engulfed by the star itself. But even at a safe distance, the sheer luminosity of UI Scuti would present extreme conditions. Firstly, the habitable zone around UI Scuti, where a planet could theoretically support liquid water, would be vastly further out, extending billions of kilometers from the star, much farther than the distance between the Sun and Pluto. Any planet within this zone would experience a significantly reduced day-night cycle, or none at all, depending on its orbit, leading to extreme temperatures across its surface. Furthermore, the gravitational effects of such a massive star could result in intense tidal forces, potentially rendering any orbiting planet geologically active or even tearing it apart if it ventured too close. The immense wind and radiation emitted by UI Scuti could strip away any atmosphere that a planet in its vicinity might have, leaving it exposed to the harshness of space. Fun fact, if Earth orbited UI Scuti, Aside from the likelihood of it not being able to retain its atmosphere, the calendar year would be incredibly long, extending into thousands of our current years due to the vast distance required to maintain a stable orbit. Seasons as we know them would be entirely redefined, assuming Earth's tilt and orbit could somehow create a semblance of them around such a star. Orbiting UI Scuti would present a reality starkly different from our own, one where the conditions that foster life as we know it are unlikely to be met. This hypothetical journey underscores the delicate balance of factors that make Earth uniquely suited for life in the vastness of the cosmos. Embarking on a thought experiment, let's consider the impact on hypothetical planets orbiting these celestial titans. Orbiting the Sun, planets like Earth thrive in the habitable zone, where temperatures allow water to exist in liquid form a crucial ingredient for life as we know it. The Sun's stable luminosity and gravitational pull have fostered a delicate balance, 
enabling life to flourish on our planet for billions of years. Its light and warmth regulate our climate, drive weather patterns and sustain photosynthesis, the foundation of Earth's food chain. Now imagine if Earth orbited UI Scuti. Given its colossal size and luminosity, any habitable zone would be vastly further out, making it challenging for life as we know it to exist. The intense radiation and powerful stellar winds from UI Scuti could strip away a planet's atmosphere, making it inhospitable. Furthermore, the variable brightness of such a massive star could lead to extreme temperature fluctuations on any orbiting body. For a fun fact, if Earth were placed in a stable orbit within UI Scuti's habitable zone, if such a zone could exist, it would experience daylight of a magnitude and scale beyond human comprehension, potentially altering fundamental biological processes dependent on the solar cycle. Transitioning to the fate of these stellar giants, the life cycle of stars is a narrative of cosmic birth, life and death. Stars are born in nebulae, vast clouds of gas and dust. Under the force of gravity, these clouds collapse, forming protostars that eventually ignite nuclear fusion in their cores. The Sun, a middle-aged star, will continue to fuse hydrogen into helium for about 5 billion more years. As it exhausts its hydrogen fuel, it will expand into a red giant, engulfing the inner planets, including Earth, before shedding its outer layers to form a planetary nebula, leaving behind a white dwarf. UI Scuti, on the other hand, faces a more tumultuous end. Its massive size predicates a short lifespan, culminating in a spectacular supernova explosion. This cataclysmic event will not only mark the end of UI Scuti, but also seed the cosmos with heavy elements essential for the birth of new stars, planets, and potentially life. The remnants of UI Scuti may collapse into a neutron star, or, if massive enough, a black hole. A fittingly dramatic conclusion to the life of one of the universe's most immense stars. This exploration into the life and death of stars not only highlights the dynamic processes governing the cosmos, but also underscores the transient nature of the universe itself. Stars like the Sun and UI Scuti, though seemingly eternal, navigate through phases of existence that mirror the broader cycles of cosmic evolution, from the formation of the simplest atoms to the complex dance of galaxies. In this cosmic journey, we've traversed the vast expanse from the familiar warmth of our Sun to the awe-inspiring might of UI Scuti, the largest star known in the universe. We've compared their sizes, luminosities, and destinies, marveled at the theoretical impact on hypothetical planets, and contemplated the ultimate fate awaiting these celestial titans. This exploration serves as a vivid reminder of the universe's grandeur and the humbling scale of celestial objects that dot our night sky. As we wrap up this interstellar voyage, let's carry forward a sense of wonder for the cosmic ballet that unfolds across the eons, a testament to the ever-changing, dynamic nature of the universe. With that said, thanks for watching. If you've enjoyed this celestial journey, don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment with your thoughts or questions. Have you ever wondered about the scale of other cosmic phenomena, or the mysteries that lie hidden within the depths of the universe? Share your curiosity, and who knows, our next journey might just delve into the answers you seek. Until next time, keep looking up and marveling at the wonders of the cosmos.